guys, welcome to Pep Live. I'm JP, your host, and we have for tonight isa sa banner artists ng Sparkle JP Artist Center at syempre mapapanood natin sa much anticipated version ng GMA ng Voltes 5 Legacy. We have Jamie herself, Isabel Ortega. Hello, yes. Isabel. Yes, hello. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Jim C. Good evening, Isabel. <laughs> Buti na kitang ma-introduce na Jamie. So, <laughs> okay, guys, naman. Pwede naman, uh, di ba? Pwede rin, Because pwede rin. Pasok uh -oh. naman. Lalo na with your new hairstyle, o di ba? Yes. Nabati nga natin kanina ang iyong uh -oh, new look. Okay. <laughs> new year, new new hair, di ba? Usually, ganun yung sinasabi ng mga tao nagpapagupit sa new year. <laughs> Correct. So, ganun ang ganap mo sa iyong hair ngayon. Yes. Uh -oh. Dahil uh -oh. maraming exciting things this year, dapat makisabay yung hair sa mga ganap. <laughs> Correct. At nako, pag-uusapan natin ng ilan sa mga exciting things na yan mamaya. Ano, ano ba ang meron kay Isabel? what she has in store for us. And of course, for our pepsters na nanonood sa ating ngayon sa ating platforms ng Facebook, YouTube, and Kumu, mag-comment lang kayo sa ating comment section ng inyong mga questions, ng inyong mga comments, mga gusto nyo sabihin kay Isabel, may mga tanong kayo about Voltes 5 and all her other projects. So i-comment nyo lang dyan. And syempre, mas maganda kung magsasend kayo ng inyong stars and ng gifts sa Kumu para mas happy tayong lahat, ba? Diba? And... With that, okay, eto na, Isabel. Bago tayo mag-umpisa, yeah. syempre, kailangan muna meron tayong paunang ano, paunang ganap. At yon ay ang ating <laughs> icebreaker challenge. And this icebreaker challenge is first and last. Okay. Okay, coming from the title, first and last, mayroon akong five questions sa'yo na about your firsts and about your last. So, mga trivial okay. things lang naman. So, kung ready ka na, ready, ready ka na to share, i-share mo lang sa amin yan. And wala kami namang okay. choice, i-share mo rin. Charot. Oo, uh, okay. mukha. <laughs> exciting, exciting. <laughs> so, Babe. ready ka na ba, Isabel? Yes, ready na. Okay, first question. First thing you did today, o, oh, app na app. Check my phone. <laughs> mm. Yun agad, mm -hmm. yes. Uh -oh. Ako, ano yan? As in every day, you check for your phone. Yan ang una oh, mo. Ano. Diba, ang daming mga tao na parang, oh, they have a morning morning ritual, ganyan. Pero sadly, all, the first thing I do is check my phone. Parang, yun. Hindi ko, ano eh. Hindi ko kayang iwanan. <laughs> wow. Ayun. Correct. Well, kasi naman sa schedule mo din, di ba? Siyempre, kailangan mo malaman ang schedule mo for the day. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Check the notifs, so, the emails, ganun. So far ba, ito lang ang schedule mo for the day, ang ating pep life, or marami ka rin ganap kanina? Wala naman. Ito, ito lang naman. Uh, nandito kasi ako ngayon sa La Union, eh. so more of um, nag-rest muna ako with my family, ganun. So chill-chill lang dito. <laughs> mm, ang ganda nga ng iyong ano, pa-background. Oh, diba? Thank Very you, good. diba? May, may fake plant na malaki Correct. dito. Correct. <laughs> ang laki. <laughs> okay. O, oh, itong next. Okay. Last person you talk to. So, sino ang huli mong kausap before tayo nagsimula? Um, may ate. Kasi nanghingi ako ng water. Nagsimula <laughs> 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 siya kanina. Nanghingi ako ng water, di ba? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ayun naman. Sasabihin ko sana yung walang kinalaman sa live, ano? Pero carry naman. <laughs> Dahil ano, buti na lang nandiyan si ate mo para ready yes. agad ang water. Yes, true. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. diba? So, stay hydrated yeah. tayo. <laughs> Correct. Okay, itong next. Nako, ito cute mm -hmm. lang ng konti. First time you had a crush. Ooh. Parang kinder pa lang ata. May crush-crushies na ako eh. <laughs> diba? Gets naman yan. Patang bata pa lang eh. Oh. <laughs> Pero na-remember mo kung sino siya. Oh, naalala ko. Ano siya? Um, classmate ko dun sa kinder. Tapos super cute kita ko. Tapos kunwari, ano, kinuha niya yung lunchbox ko. Yung mga ganong ganap ng bata, di ba? Ayun. Uh -huh. Tapos naging crush ko na siya nung kinuha niya yung lunchbox ko. <laughs> uh -huh. Gusto ka yung ano, yun dahil sa, nadaan sa, lun sa lunchbox. Oo, uh -huh. para paraan, di ba? Kahit na bata mm -hmm. pala. <laughs> Correct. Pa ganun na eh. After na, hindi mo na siya naging ano, classmate. Hindi na kayo nagkatagpo. Parang ano, Basta, alam ko, matagal ko siya, siya naging crush eh. Pero, naging, hindi ko na siya naging classy. Pero pag kunwari, hindi ko siya classy. Uh, Silip-silip na lang, di ba? Sa, sa 
classroom nila, ganun. Mm-hmm. Ayun naman. Oh, normal naman yan. Yan ang mga first, yes. ano natin, mga puppy love, ganun. True. Uy, Elijah Alejo is watching. Good night. Go, talaga. Isabel. Yes. Hi, Hi Ellie. Ellie. I miss you. <laughs> Yan. Okay, oh, ito next. Last TV show you binged on. Ooh. I'm sure ang daming nakaka-relate sa akin. Pero right now, I'm watching All of Us Are Dead. So, ang daming, for sure, ang daming rin na akong kadamay dito sa show na to na ang daming nanonood. I swear, ang ganda nung show. So, yan. Mm-hmm. That's what I've been watching every night. So, mahili ka sa zombies? Mahilig sa Korean. Sa mga ah, Korean, Korean series. Oo. Mm-hmm. So, nung nalaman ko na, yun nga, may bagong zombie series ang um, on Netflix talaga. Nanood ako. Nanood agad ako. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, yes. Ay, well, yun. Sinabi mo naman kanina na ikaw ay, ano, nagandahan and mm-hmm. natuwa. Pero, ano super. ba yung mga, ano, parang, super. Yun. Yes. Ano ba yung mga parang TV shows na talagang, ano, nag-binge ka? Yung parang, hindi mo kailang, hindi mo pwedeng pala- pinalagpas. Hindi mo pwedeng pinalagpas. Ah. Well, of course. Siguro, ano, yung pinaka-recent was start up. Actually, mm. hindi na rin ganun ka-recent eh, pero nirewatch ko, nirewatch ko siya like during my quarantine. Tapos, um, ano pa ba? All of us are dead. Uh, hmm. Friends. Yun. Mm, so, yes, yun, of recently, course. Recently, palagi ako nagre-rewatch ng series eh. So, yun. Friends, always. Palagi oh yan. Oh my God. 24-7. <laughs> Magkakasundo tayo sa friends. Ang saya, yes. di ba? Super. Hindi ano, nakakasawa. Okay, ah, ito na naman. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, sino ang favorite mo? Baka oh, talagang ch- ina na na, chinika na. <laughs> sino ang favorite mo sa friends? Oh, Ross. I love Ross. Oh. Sobrang funny niya. Pero favorite character ko siguro si Joey. Pero silang mm-hmm. dalawa, actually. I silang really. dalawa. Mm-hmm. Yes. Ayun naman. Ang galing. Okay. Ross and ano, Joey. Okay. Ito yes. last. First TV appearance. So, throwback. Ah. First TV appearance. On the Wings of Love. Ha. Ah, yun na yes. talaga. Ang first. Yes. Uh-oh. Mm. So, yun. Super like, as in, wala pa ako experience no. Hindi pa ako nagka-commercial. As in, so, parang, the fact na yun agad yung first appearance ko, it was super exciting, super nakakakaba, of course. Pero yun, sobrang in-enjoy ko yung first TV appearance ko na yun. Mm-hmm. So yun na pala, no? hindi kasi syempre baka mamaya, ano pala, nag, nag-bit roles ka sa ibang shows na ano, yes. pero hot wall pa rin pala talaga yung unang oh, una, as it walang ano, galing. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, Hot wall naman, and, ngayon, di ba, although ikaw ay nasa GMA na, pero yun na nga, diretso na tayo sa ating Q&A, dahil <laughs> recently you were launched as part of the banner artists of Sparkle, yeah. kayong walo, di ba, with, okay, isa-isahin natin, Gabi, Kalil, Miguel, Sanya, Derek, Bianca, Luru. So, yeah. yun. So, and among <laughs> these seven, ikaw yung parang pinaka-new, ano, sa kanilang lahat. Yes. Oh my God, mm-hmm. yes. <laughs> So, kamusta lang? Yung feeling mo, like, kunyari, di ba, nag-media tayo weeks ago, tapos parang mm-hmm. kasama mo na sila, and then nag-perform din kayo sa New Year Countdown. So, kamusta? Yung parang feeling na, oh my gosh, I'm part of this bunch. Yes. Ayun, super, super, until now, parang, of course, parang, naninibago pa rin ako, and it's honestly really exciting nung nalaman ko na magiging part ako ng group na to. Ang um, una ko talagang inisip is, um, growth talaga. Kasi, yun, when they told me na I was going to be a part of it, parang sabi nila na, okay, let's let's work hard um, this 2022. So, nag-workshop kami last year. Um, ang dami kong ginawa rin na, um, na, yun nga, acting workshops, dance workshops, dami preparations for this. So, super exciting kasi ang daming bagong opportunities. And yun nga, since um, ako, isa ako sa mga bago din dito sa network na part ng group na to, syempre excited ako to work with all of them. Kasi, ang dami pa sa kanilang hindi ko pa nakakatrabaho. So yeah, very exciting. And super grateful, of course, to GMA mm-hmm. na naging part ako ng group na to. So far, ano yung mga parang naging ano na, changes sa iyong ano, career since you were launched as part of the Banner Artists? My hair. <laughs> 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 Ito na yung my hair. 
<laughs> Ayun. Um, siguro, um, changes. Of course, syempre, there are new opportunities. And then, as we know, Valtus 5 Legacy. And as well as what we could be yung isang series ko din this year. So, syempre yun, maraming um, pwedeng i-look forward yung mga viewers and yung mga kapuso um, when it comes to mga ganaps this year. <laughs> mm-hmm. At galing, no? Ito na, parang kumbaga, syempre kasi nag- nag-wait ka din talaga for the right break, di ba? And then yes. ito na, it's finally, ano, coming sa'yo this yes. year. Yes, of course, super exciting. And, uh, yun nga, first time kong mag-lead sa isang series, so that's, so exciting and then ito pang sparkle na tong um, group na to sobrang daming dapat maging grateful ako for this year and I really am super yun naman and ayan simulan yeah. na natin ang pang kalkal sa iyong ano magagawin <laughs> this year kalkal diba? okay. na dyan, of course 2020 pa lang naman tama ba 2020 kayo in-announce or 2021 Pero 2020 kami na cast 2021 kami in-announce so may one year mm-hmm. kaming naghintay at nag nag-shush muna. <laughs> Correct. Na ang tagal, di ba? And finally now, and pwedeng-pwede na, as in, free na to make kweto <laughs> ang Voltes yeah. 5 Legacy and you are playing Jamie. Di ba? Oh my gosh. So, kamusta? Mm-hmm. No, parang yun lang, na yung experience ngayon na finally, you can let this out, you can share it to everyone. Mm-hmm. Super exciting and yun nga, super nakakatuwa kasi parang yun, one year kami naghintay. One year kami na quiet lang about um, Voltus 5. So, parang nung time yun, hindi pa talaga nagsisink in sa akin na ako na si Jamie kasi wala pa talaga nakakaalam eh. Tapos yun, nung 2021 nung in-announce kami, parang pag, <laughs> pag tuwing may magsasabi sa akin, ay Jamie, Jamie, congrats, ganyan. Parang yung instinct ko is parang mag, ganun eh. Kasi <laughs> ang tagal ko na nakasush. Pero yun nga, sobrang exciting. And the whole process, especially nung Una kong sinuot yung costume ko, parang sobrang nakaka-goosebumps, di ba? Kasi syempre alam mo na sobrang malapit yung Voltus 5 sa puso ng maraming fans nila and of course sa ating mga Pilipino and to so many other viewers. So to see, you know, yung in-envision nila direct mark and yung seeing the series come to life, sobrang nakaka-excite and sobrang nakaka-honor. It's such an honor to be a part of this process. Correct. Ayun naman. Pero, syempre maganda rin, balikan natin, no? Parang ito kasi yung yeah. first interview mo sa amin and dito yes. pwede ka na mag, ano talaga, dish out ng details. At nag-comment ng heart emoji si Elijah. Ellie, thank you for watching. <laughs> I for love you, Ellie. Diba? Pero, ayan, balikan natin yung time. Ayan, sabi niya pala, I miss you too. Oo. Mm-hmm. Uh, tagal na namin din nakikita ni Ellie, eh. Yan. So, ayun, balikan natin yung parang ano, yung audition, yung parang paano nagsimula ang journey mo as Jamie and yung journey mo rin sa Voltes 5 coming from the audition. Yes. Actually, hindi ko talaga plan mag-audition and I've shared this na rin before pero yun, never ko talaga pinlan mag-audition as Jamie. I wasn't even supposed to be um, auditioning that day kaso nag kataon na nandun ako sa compound ng ABS. And then it was my handler who was like, yeah, let's, let's try. Let's try to audition. Diba? Malay mo. Pero hindi ko talaga inisip na mag-audition kasi sabi ko parang, alam mo yun, syempre yung nerves, yung yung importance talaga ng Jamie sa show. So hindi ko inisip na parang try ko yung challenge yun. Inisip ko na baka hindi ko naman din makukuha ganun. Pero yun, when I auditioned, as in sobrang I fell in love with the character, I fell in love with the script. And then, yun, talaga nagdasal ako. And everyday halos nun, parang kinukulit ko na yung ate, yung handler ko si ate Crystal kung may update na ba sa audition, ganun. And then, yeah, I remember I waited for a few weeks. Tapos super talagang kinakabahan ako nun na nagpapray talaga ako na makuha ko. And then, when I found out, talagang I cried. <laughs> Umiyak talaga ako nun, JP, kasi as in, they, they surprised me. Eh. They didn't tell me through the phone, mm-hmm. parang they, they called me pa, tapos sabi nila na it's another audition, parang um, look test ulit to, so punta ka ganyan, pero di ko alam na, yun na pala yun, na they called me to tell me na part ako ng Voltus 5, and ako na si Jamie, so I really cried so hard, kasi <laughs> di ko talaga in-expect, and yun, super grateful ako noong time na yun. Makabawal mag-name ng names, no? pero marami kang nakasabay during your audition. Actually, ang alam ko is yes, marami nag-audition, pero I was parang tail, 
pumunta na ako dun sa audition kasi tail end na eh. So, I only got to see a few. Pero yes, I heard. Yes, marami din. Mm-hmm. May mga friends ka na nakita? Um, some. Yes, oo, mm-hmm. some. Ayun. Grabe, no? And syempre, <laughs> grabe ang support nyo sa isa't isa. Pero yun nga. I'm sure daming na happy sa'yo when you got the role. Yes. Mm-hmm. So, rin yun sa reasons ko. <laughs> Bakit ako umiyak? Kasi alam mo yun. Um, it feels nice na, you know, so much people are rooting for you. So much people are happy for you. And, of course, isa na dun yung mga friends ko sa GMA. And how supportive everyone was of me. So, nakaka, nakakataba ng puso. And, syempre, yun. Mm-hmm. Kaya, dun ako super grateful nun. Ito naman siguro pwede nang i-share. Pero ano yung mga ginawa yeah. nyo sa audition? Paano mo finish? Sino mga kaharap mo? <laughs> mga pinagawa sa'yo? Um, actually, I think nasa YouTube din yung audition clip ko eh, sa Voltus 5. Mm, okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. along with yung reaction video ko na <laughs> umiiyak ako. But, uh-huh. yeah, um, I remember meron kaming isang um, script na scene. It was a scene in the actual series. And then, we also had a fight scene. Tapos yung fight scene na yun, I remember mga 15 minutes lang din yung yung binigay sa amin para aralin yung scene. And I remember nun, parang sabi ko, oh my gosh, sobrang kinabahan ako kasi hindi pa ako talaga nagkaroon ng experience sa martial arts or sa any action role. Um, mm-hmm. So, given that na, alam mo yun, kailangan ko aralin yung, yung stunt na yun in that amount of time, sabi ko, oh my gosh, kailangan ko pa mag-training, kailangan, kong, kailangan ko pa mag-level up if, if mapupunta sa akin yung role na to. And, yun, after nung audition na yun, talagang nag, nag-training ako, even if I didn't know kung makukuha ko man or hindi. Pero as in, yun pa lang, sabi ko, no, kailangan ko na mag-start, kailangan, kailangan ko na itong anahan. Um, kailangan ko na i-pour yung heart ko dito sa role na to. Kahit hindi pa ako sigurado na mapapas sa akin. Correct. Ganun naman dapat kiklaim mo na, o oh, diba? Yes. <laughs> Work naman sa'yo ang pag-claim. Uh-huh. Talagang love, ano, love. manifestation. Attraction, Correct, you know? diba? <laughs> Mm, and bukod doon, talagang you did the work, di ba? Na inifortan mo talaga. So, deserve yes. naman. Sabi nga ng Isagal Hearts, deserve. At saka Thank ni Eurostachi. You. Proud kami sa'yo, Isa. Deserve mo yan. <laughs> Thank saka you, si guys. Saka Monto. Well deserved. Thank you. Uh, yan, I worked so hard for it. Siguro mga halos almost two years din ako nag-train. Kasi nung nagka-pandemic, talagang hindi talaga ako tumigil. Ang dami ko iba't ibang um, martial arts na inaral. So, Thank you, guys. <laughs> Thank you. I'm not sure if you were able to share this or you were asked this way back then. No? Pero kasi, syempre, yun nga. Nabitin. Because nagkaroon ng pandemic, eh. So, before the pandemic, you were cast na, di ba? Kompleto na kayo. I mean, kayong lima na yun. Tapos, yun nga, nagkaroon ng pandemic. How did you feel? Nakinabahan ka ba na parang, my gosh, baka ma-shelve yung project? Kasi it's such a big show. And we all know kung gano'ng kahirap mag-bound ng ganito, di ba? Pag na, ngayong pandemic. Mm-hmm. Super. I think I think all of us then, the ba, we didn't know what was gonna happen. Kasi, syempre, first time natin ma-encounter yung ganitong pandemic na puro work from home. So, it wasn't just uh, Voltus 5 yung kinabahan ako. Pero, of course, for the whole industry, the ba? Kasi, ang daming yeah. nag-stop ng taping. Ang daming talagang, ang daming, actually, lahat to Miguel. So, sobrang bago yun. And, sobrang parang yun nga, sabi ko, ano, what's next for, what's next for everyone, di ba? So, ayun, parang, I really prayed na lang talaga. And, sabi ko, hindi, hindi ako titigil. Hindi ako titigil. Kasi kung titigil ako, baka mas kabahan pa ako. So, basta, eyes on the prize lang ako. So, yun, I just kept training. Um, and honestly, na-relieve din ako, in a way, kasi sabi ko, at least may time pa to prepare. And, mas may time pa ako na talagang paghandaan yung role na to. Especially physically. Kasi, you know, um, sobrang bago sa akin yung action role. Tapos, ninja pa si Jamie. So, syempre, kailangan, you know, well-equipped talaga siya. And, makikita mo rin kasi talaga kung naghanda yung, 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 yung actor na yun for that role, eh. Diba? Lalo yeah. na physical. So, I really wanted to um, be ready. Which, mm-hmm. it paid off naman. Yan. So, Perfect. silver lining na rin yun. Mm-hmm. Hanggang sa na-announce na. And then, pumasok na kay sa bubble. So, yeah. The first time that you entered the bubble and you saw the set, yung location ninyo, kamusta? Kamusta kayong lahat? 
alam mo yung feeling na parang ang tagal mo nang ini-envision yung 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 set na yon na makakatrabaho ka na ulit and especially with with the people na halos isang taon na kayong naghahanda with parang sobrang like okay this is it this is it general assembly pa lang namin on the day before we started working parang tinitigan ko ulit yung mga iba kong castmates alala ko na sa meeting kami no tapos listening to direct mark parang sabi ko oh my gosh this is it This is it. This is, alam mo yun, parang sobrang goosebumps. Especially nung una kong sinuot yung costume with makeup, with hair, um, and then seeing everyone na nasa set. Um, everyone in costume. Sobrang sabi ko, okay, yeah, this is this is more than what I pictured when we were talking about it pa lang. So, sobrang dami rin kailangan i-look forward yung mga viewers when it comes to this. Kasi pati kami. Wala, until now, nagugulat pa rin kami sa nakikita namin, sa mga shoot namin. So, I'm sure lahat din sila. And of course, sana ma-appreciate din nila yung hard work namin lahat. Yun na nga yung nakakatawa kasi we all know naman, every time naman na magkakaroon ng adaptation, especially if it's a foreign work na gagawing, Pilip- fi- gagawing Filipino work, di ba talagang ang daming komento ng mga tao, hindi mo ma-replace talaga lahat. But, nung ipinalabas sa New Year Countdown, yung parang, yung special primer ninyo, di ba? Ang daming na-impress. So, how did you feel na parang, my gosh, parang, ano yun, you've proven the critics wrong. Although, yeah, it has yet to be aired, pero, hello, primer na, primer pa lang yun, ang dami nang na-impress, yes. di ba? It was more of like, parang, yung feeling na, see hey guys, I told you. <laughs> Kasi honestly, ever since the start, parang, ang, ang, Um, ang laki na ng, ng belief ko dito sa show na to. Um, I remember nung day one pa lang talaga nung sinabi nila sa akin nila, Misela nila, direct mark na, you're gonna be a part of the show. Pinakita na nila sa akin yung clip nun ng mga um, ng mga ships namin lahat na nag-revolt in. And when I first saw it pa lang, sabi ko, oh my gosh, gawa yan dito? Like, we did that? Nakaka-proud. Sobrang nakaka-proud. So, When I saw the future at then, parang hindi na rin ako na nagulat na ang daming napahanga kasi ayun, sabi ko talaga na yes, mm-hmm. yes. This is it. And it, of course, it was I felt so proud to be a part of that, to be a part of this. And ang dami ko ring mga first na clips na nakita eh ng feature natin kasi sobrang secretive din nila direct mark pati sa amin na part na ng show. <laughs> sobrang secretive pa rin nila. So isa rin ako sa mga namangha, isa rin ako sa mga nagulat, at isa rin ako sa mga nagsasabi na, yes, this is it, mm-hmm. guys. Um, isa pa lang to. Featurette ka pala yung tawag doon, hindi primer, sorry. Pag primer yeah. kasi, dapat <laughs> eh, na, di ba? So, featurette. Mm-hmm. Pero yun nga, ang dami na, ayan o, oh, sabi ni Jerilyn Esther, ang ganda ng featurette ng Voltas 5 Legacy. And, ang ganda din na sa inyo din, very secretive, secretive sila, direct mark. Uh-oh. And, Nakakatuwa rin, Isabel, no? Baby ka na rin ni Direct Mark. We all know na lahat ng nagiging baby ni Direct Mark sa mga shows niya talaga nagtitake off at bongga ang mga ganap-ganap. So, nafe-feel mo na ba yan? Mga ganyang ganap? Um, well, yes, of course. Sobrang laking difference ng Vault S5. And feeling ko sobrang um, laking change din talaga to for, for my career and for my path dito sa GMA. Yung, yung part ako ng Vault S5. And of course, to work with Derek Mark, it's an honor talaga, and ang dami kong natututunan from him, and lahat kami talagang sobrang grateful, of course, to be a part of this. And baby rin to, baby rin to ni Derek Mark, eh, yung Vault is Five, he's such yeah. a, I mean, not just him, but then everyone in the show is so passionate about this. So, nakaka, nakaka-inspire din, na nakaka-motivate na makatrabaho mo yung mga tao na ganito ka laki yung passion for this, for the show, for this, for their craft. Yeah, so, mm-hmm. Very exciting. And nako, eto na, magtutuloy-tuloy na because kanina lang, di ba si Rafael ay ano na, na vaccinate, vaccinated na siya, finally. Yes. No? So, yes. Pwede na, di ba? Oo. So, Tagal naming hinintay. Oh my gosh. Sobrang miss na namin na and sobrang wino-wish na rin namin na makompleto kaming lima. So, sobrang exciting. Mm-hmm. Tapos so funny yan. So, medyo ano ba? Nakikita niya na ba yung end? Hindi ko baga parang ito na, ready to air na. Ganun. Um, <laughs> actually, <laughs> just like you're saying, I'm direct mark. Medyo 50% pa lang kami talaga sa mga sinushoot. And of course, this is our first lock-in pa lang yung next namin. Hopefully, na kasama si Little John 
So, yung mga iconic scenes na mga isushoot namin together, yun, ma-shoot na namin finally. So, siguro, yeah, I can see na, I can see it all coming together na, lalo na na ito, makakasama na namin si Little John. And makakawork na namin si Little John, finally. O, oh, pero kayo nila Miguel, nila Radson, and Matt, no? Kamusta yung bond as, you know, part of the Voltes 5? Na kayo lima, the Voltes team. Mm-mm. Sobrang saya, as in. Kasi, you know, I feel like I I didn't just gain new co-workers, but I also gained um, new friends with them. Kasi yun nga, um, halos isang taon din namin nilihim yung yung part kami ng Voltus 5. So, alam mo yun, we, we, made, we made the most of that time. Talagang ginawa namin ng time para mag-bond, para to get to know each other. So, yun, pag-apak namin ng set, sobrang comfortable na namin sa si isa't isa. And yung comfort na yun, and yung the fact na nag enjoy din kami na makatrabaho yung isa't isa. Siyempre, nagtatranslate din yun on screen, lalo na yun, na-team kami. So, yun, sobrang happy ako, and sobrang saya na lang makasama, makatrabaho. Mm-hmm. Sa ano, di ba? Sa tunay na Voltes 5, may mga kinig na eksena ba kayo dito ni Miguel? Tsaka pati ni Radson, di ba? Parang, tayang gets ba? <laughs> um, well, kailangan nila abangan yun. I'm not allowed pa masyado to share. Bawal pa, share. okay. Oo, uh-huh. mm-hmm. pero yun, yung, marami rin nagtatanong about that, about the plot of Voltes 5. Pero, um, siguro masasabi ko lang is, um, huwag masyado mag-alala yung mga fans ng Voltes 5. Kasi, you know, parang, You know, we're we're st- we're sticking through to the story, and really, yung yung concept talaga ng Vault is Five is there. Um, and if ever man na may bagong layers na idadagdag kami dito sa show na to, of course, um, it's really to make the show better. And sobrang ganda ng mga bagong elements na dinagdag ng ng series ng mga writers sila ni Suzette dito sa show na to. So it's going to be so exciting. It's going to be um, it's going to be new and old at the same time. Mm-hmm. Correct. Yeah. Yung kahit may bagong mga nilagay. Or, syempre kasi it's 2022 or mm-hmm. kung kailan man kayo i-air eh, di ba? Pero, anong tawag dito? Syempre, hindi pwedeng mawala yung, kumbaga, yung original flavor ng of all course. this time. Ano yun? Go lang yan. Carry lang yan. Chill <laughs> lang tayo dito. Casual lang tayo dito. Yes. So, <laughs> ano man yan, carry na yan. Yes. Okay. Hindi kasi siyempre, ayun nga, ay, ano ko na rin na, kasi may, ano, first time yung mag-pair ni Miguel para may shippers na kayo, but kung hindi muna kayo mapapanood dito sa Voltes 5, may isa pang inaabangang project sa inyo na co-produced ata ng Quantum, no? Tama ba? Yes, Quantum yes. Film. Yes, it's what we could be. Kay Isabel yeah. nang galing yung title, kanina hindi ko maalala kung ano yung title. <laughs> <laughs> Pero tinanong ko niya. So yun, ito naman, gano'n naman ito ka-different. Parang this one is not fantasy, ano? Yes. Wait lang. Sorry, JMP. I'm so sorry. Nalobat lang kasi yung laptop ko. Ay, sorry, go na! Sige. Okay, oh, habang, na- nag- habang nagahanap, na- habang isinasak sa akin Isabel ang ating, ay, ang kanyang laptop. Ayan, okay na ba siya? Ayan. Yes, I am okay. okay. Sorry. Ayan, okay na. Ang laki ng face. <laughs> Nasasaka ako pag sinuzoom. Ang laki kasi. Anyway. <laughs> yun. Okay. O, oh, itali natin yan. So, what we could be. Ito naman. Ano naman itong ano nyo? Project nyo na ito ni Miguel. Yes. Ayun. This is going to be, like what you mentioned, a collaboration with Quantum Films and GMA. And um, it's going to be directed by Director Jeffrey Jaturian. And yun. Sobrang exciting. Kasi syempre, of course, um, ang daming... Um, bago for this. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a lot of first also. Yun, first collaboration to ng GMA and Quantum. And then I think this is Direct Jeffrey's first show again in GMA after so long. Yeah, after many and, years. Yes, after many years. And of course, first, ano ko rin to? Technically, first um, time ko mag-lead in a series kasi this will be coming before Vault is 5. So that's also exciting. And of course, um, working with Miguel again here Um, it's very exciting kasi yun nga, makasama na kami sa Voltes. And to work with him again here dito so what he could be is, um, of course, so exciting. And yun, um, talagang mm-hmm. I'm sure they will look forward to this show. And I'm not sure if pwede pa namin talaga i-divulge i- um, kung ano yung plot ng story. Pero, ayun, basta, it's going to be released this year. Tentivate. Naisip ko na yung itatanong ko, ha? Na naisip din ni Euros Pachi, kailan sasabihin yung synopsis ng What We Could Be? Excited ako na. Pero yun nga, Uh-oh. and you know, pwede bang ano, may konting hint lang kung anong klase siyang palabas, gano'n. Um, hmm. 
Pwede ko na ba sabihin? Um, well, siguro pwede na lang sila makakuha ng hint sa OST ng ng show namin. Um, yung original yung soundtrack ng show namin will be ano, Pano by Zach Tabudlo. Yan, yes, tama. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pano by Zach Tabudlo. So expect nila na medyo mapanakit or you know, medyo around that um, <laughs> around that plot mm-hmm. yung show na to. Ayun, kasi wala siya nun sa ano eh, sa lineup ng show sa GMA or yeah. um fun fact, it was a it was mentioned but hindi nila alam kung ano yung show ni kasi iba yung pangalan niya dati but yeah. ah okay so nandoon din yan sa titles na di ba naglabas ng omnibus na photo title lang yeah. ah so nandoon na yon pero uh, ibang title uh, so mystery na lang muna kung alin doon yun <laughs> kung alin yung okay, story okay. doon <laughs> wag kang exit after nito tatanungin ko charot kami lang hindi <laughs> kay kasama okay. <laughs> <laughs> kasi ano, di ba pwede? Pag pwede ng air-reveal, tsaka natin i-reveal in pop. Yes. Uh-huh. It's worth the wait, guys. Promise. <laughs> you're starting now with that. Anytime soon. We are about to start. I think first mm-hmm. quarter or second quarter ng year na to, um, magsistart na kami mag-film. So, ayan, we're already preparing the script and then I think the cast is being formed already. So... Ayun. Pero of course, as everyone knows, uh, as everyone has seen then, um, kasama din namin dito si Yasser. So I think that's all pa lang din talaga na we can reveal about the plot and the show. Great. Nakawork pa ba si Derek Jeff sa ABS? Not yet. I, this is my first mm-hmm. time working so, with him also. Time. Yes. Mm-hmm. Galing, very fresh, no? Correct, yun nga kasi yung ano niya, first project after many years sa GMA. And then ikaw ang ano, ikaw ang debut niya, kumbaga, sa series. <laughs> Yes. Very exciting, no? At least, ano, yun nga, exciting times for you. Kasi, ang daming aabangan. Voltes 5, and then, eto muna pala, what we could be. And then, All Out Sundays daw kanina, may nag-comment dito. si Kristen Sene <laughs> Collis, ang galing-galing mong sumayaw sa All Out Sundays, Isabel Ortega. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Bakit ka nahiya? Parang nahiya ka? <laughs> Hindi ko alam ko bakit ako sa But thank you. Thank you for noticing. Hindi <laughs> kasi talaga ako dancer, Jim B. Pero I'm trying. Alam mo yun. So, syempre, pag may nagsasabi nun, napaplatter ako, natutuwa ako. Kasi at least mm-hmm. worth it yung, worth it yung, yung pag, uh, ano, pag-workshop ko, yung hard work ko dyan sa All Out on Days. <laughs> okay. At least so, naman, di ba? Tsaka ano, napakita mo na yung ano, skill mo na yun. Kahit sabi mo hindi ka dancer, <laughs> pero kita mo naman yes. impress, di ba? Yes, of pero course. Pero ano pala? Ah, go. Ayun, of course, yun. And he, uh, of course, to make the viewers happy, di ba? Siyempre, we have to, ano, uh, do our best. <laughs> Yan. Pero ito pala, hindi kasi, di ba, when you were launched nga as part of the banner Stars of Sparkle, siyempre, naging medyo semi-reunion yun rin ni Mr. M na nakasama mo sa ABS. So, kamusta lang na nakita kayo ulit? Na parang, siyempre, it's been so long, ilang years na, and then here you are na magkasama kayo. Of course, you know, I'm uh, laki rin ng ng um ng utang na love ko of course kay Mr. M um because yun nga when i was starting uh, my career it was him um he was one of the people who really believed in me and you know i've worked with him for many years before so now knowing that he's here also with us in GMA syempre it's such a it's it's, it's, it's an exciting time kasi yun nga parang it's going to be um there's going to be some changes there's going to be you know um things na um, di rin ko pa na-experience um, when I worked with him before. Diba? So, it was very exciting when I found out. And of course, always grateful to Mr. M and Ms. Mariol. And especially here then with with Sparkle. Diba? I'm so grateful to to him for the opportunity. And of course, sa Artist Center, sa Sparkle Artist Center, yan sila, Ms. Gigi, to, to, my, to my manager and everything. So, yun. I was very excited to work with him again. Yon, oh, coming from that, no, the we put kasi GMA ng 2019. So far, kamusta ang ano? Pagiging kapuso, regardless sa pag-launch just ano, Sparkle Banner Artist, pero in the whole experience simula nung no, nag-transfer ka until now. Yeah, it, uh, it's it's been so good po as in parang alam mo yon, when I when I first Except in GMA when I first met, for example, yung mga co or co-actors ko sa first show ko, sobrang I felt at home na talaga. Everyone was so welcoming. 
Um, everyone was so warm to me. And I, hindi ako nagkaroon ng parang adjustment period with the people I worked with. Kasi sobrang saya na nila agad. And sobrang welcoming na talaga nila. And ever since, er, you know, um, sobrang grateful ako sa takbo ng mga bagay-bagay when it comes to my career. And lalo na ngayon, I'm very excited. Kasi yun nga, because I graduated already um full full time na ako dito full time na akong full force na ako dito sa sa um you know so sa year ko yes yeah. so yun because of that then i've gained so many friends i've gained so many um new experiences working with um uh, many other people and yeah i feel like kahit na two or three years na ako dito sa GMA and dami ko pang gustong makatrabaho dami ko pang gustong makasama and ang dami ko pang dapat maranasan dito na excited ako to to experience. Kasi nga naman nga, for the Kapuso viewers naman, they were impressed din naman sa ano talaga, naging performance mo sa The Gift. I mean, hindi kasi okay. di ba, tama ba? Paano na-share mo rin yun na you were, you read for Thea's role? Tama ba? For yung isa sa mga leading ladies sana and then you were put na as their sister ni Martin, di ba? Pero ang daming na-happy doon sa, yun nga, sa role mo dahil parang, torn ka rin between Alden and Martin uh-huh. as their kapatid, ganyan. So parang, ang daming na happy. So ano yung reaction mo? Kasi parang, yun nga, not only with the people inside GMA yung nagbigay sa'yo ng warm welcome, but also your fans and nakapuso fans na first time kang na-meet and daw, fan, ka, fan mo na, di ba? Yes. Of course, super grateful. Super, I mean, every time na, for example, may na-meet ako na, um, na yun nga, even from outside the network. And I see them and super happy nila. Especially nung no, no, may regionals pa. Um, <laughs> kasi syempre nawala na yun because of the Oo, pandemic. Oo, diba? pero Super. Pero yun, like meeting everyone sa sa mga um, regional shows namin, seeing how happy they are and seeing that they love the show, they love the gift so much. Syempre, of course, nakaka-happy yun and nakaka-proud to be a part of of that series. And... Um, Nakaka-miss talaga. I, I want to see everyone again. I want to meet everyone again. Mm-hmm. Nako, no? Di bale, at least parang slowly naman we are going back. Sana magtuloy-tuloy <laughs> na, no? Di ba? Kasi nga, correct. Parang ano rin, pwede na rin kayo mag-reunite ng mga ka- co-stars mo sa The Gift. O nga, no, si Martin, magkasama na naman kayo. Nakaksay na naman kayo dito sa Voltus 5. Oh. Uh, mm, uh, secret muna. <laughs> Pero nag, nagka-meet na kayo ulit sa ano, lock-in. Yun. Yes, apa. Nagkasabay kami mm-hmm. sa lock-in. And also, ano, um, uh, Sir Christian Vasquez is also part of Voltus 5. He was also seen in the featurette. And he was my he was my dad there in the gift. Si, ano, si Javier. Ah, yeah. so, nakakatuwa. Oo. Super exciting mm-hmm. na kasama ko rin ulit sila ng lahat. Mm-hmm. How about si, ano, Nico Antonio, di ba, he's part of ano, Voltes 5 and then he was part of ano, Otwal or hindi ba kayo naka-exena sa Otwal before? Yeah, naka-exena rin kami before. Yun, super excited ako nung nalaman ko kasi alam mo yun, parang it's a blast from the past and <laughs> ayun, happy ako na nakaka-work ko siya ulit ngayon. Mm-hmm. Galing. Actually, ang ganda ng casting ng ano din, no? Voltes 5. Although, syempre, kasi nga ang talagang revealed yung si Lamar, yung side nila Martin and then kayong Voltes team, di ba? Pero yun nga, biglang may Albert Martinez pala na pasabog. Yes. Tapos, meron pang silhouette. Pa. Hinuhulaan nila kung Oo. sino. Syempre, hindi mo sasabihin ngayon kahit ano yung ah, kaso. Sige, hindi ko natatawin. Ano mo na ako? Sush mo na. <laughs> Pero, yun di ba? May mga ganun din sila mga hulaan na nakaka-excite. Mm-hmm. Nako. So, yun na lang. Ano siguro ang inilulook forward mo with all these projects coming to you and after that no um i think yes yung pinaka of course nilo look forward ko is ma air na yung Voltus 5 um you know we've been working so hard with it um and exciting talaga yung dapat pa nila abangan and as in guys tip of the iceberg pa lang yung feature at na yun ang dami pang characters na hindi napapakilala and yun, basta sobrang, excite, sobrang exciting talaga yun. And then of course, what we could be, um, na kasama ko ulit si Miguel here in the show. So of course, it's super exciting then um, And yeah, ayun. Ang daming, daming firsts. Correct. Yes. Nako, good luck, Isabel. We're excited. You mentioned pala kanina that you graduated, no? Ano ang, ka, ano ang course mo? 
or high school ba or tama college college yes college uh-huh. um i graduated from UANP University of Asia and the Pacific tapos yung course ko is um bachelor of arts in political economy so which is mahaba grabe ang mahaba uh-huh. yung pangalan ng course eh yeah, political economy Mhm, talagang yun din ang ano ha, ang ganda ng course mo, grabe. So, buti you were able to ano, parang kahit pa paano nagkaroon ng time for career and at the same time you're able to finish your studies. Actually, medyo mahirap talaga i-balance no una. And I was really I remember um when kalagit na ng ng college um life ko, I was actually planning na rin talaga on focusing muna on school. Kasi sobrang hati talaga yung time ko noon and there were so many projects na hindi ko matanggap because I had class, mm. because I had to attend school. Kasi hindi ako online school noon eh. Talagang actual classes talaga. So, yeah. ayun, nahirapan ako. And before um, before I was planning on focusing muna talaga on my studies, but then nagkaroon din ng chance to um, transfer to GMA and then dun ko talaga sinabi na no I can't I can't quit kailangan ko tong um kailangan ko ipagsabay to I can't just give up and yun sa wakas na natawid ko din nakakapag-graduate din ako thankfully yeah. so it was worth everything talaga lahat ng sleepless nights it was worth it all Was there a show or an offer na parang talagang too good to resist or to decline but you really had to push for your studies ano yun yung parang pinanghinayangan mo sana na sa, sa work or sa school? Oo, sa work na you had to choose first kasi school. Oh. I I remember ano, it was more of just me wanting to focus kasi at that time, I was also mm. thinking of going to law school. So, iniisip ko na yun nga, baka gusto ko munang itry yung, yun nga, mag-full-time at student muna kasi gusto ko mag-law school. Pero, siguro got feel lang na sinabi and nagkaroon ako ng sign na parang no, tuloy mo lang to. Passion, passion ko kasi tong work ko na to eh, yung, yung um, acting. So, sabi ko talaga no, no. Kailangan ko rin to i-push. Kailangan. And yeah, everything went so well. Buti na lang, hindi ko tinigil. Ngayon. Mm-hmm. Pero ano, no? So, at wala namang parang major project na in-offer sa'yo before and then you had to refuse nga kasi you <laughs> had to... Dahil um, hindi mo matanggap because of school. There were some roles na would have been so good talaga if matatanggap ko. Kaso yun nga, um, because of scheduling and yun nga, because of school, tinanggihan ko na lang talaga. Um, hindi ko muna talaga natanggap. And... Sayang na, pero everything happens for a reason and yeah. I wouldn't be here where I am right now if it wasn't for my choices. So, of course, no regrets. And yeah, happy. Correct. Happy Important din naman kasi ang ano, education din talaga. Diba? Na, nasa kanya-kanya ng priorities naman yan. Pero at least ikaw, you were yeah. able to do or to experience the best of both worlds. And now, ito yeah. na, you can go showbiz. You can go full-time <laughs> na sa showbiz. Full-time diba? na, yes. Uh-oh. Sabi ni Jerry din mukhang high school talaga si Sab. Kasi nga nasabi ko kanina. Hindi, oo kasi yung baget mo talaga tignan eh. Akala ko talaga high school. 23 <laughs> na ako guys. Ha? Baka sa ano Hindi, lang. Hindi halata. Grabe. Tsaka tingin ako nga ngayon. Parang, grabe, ang kinis-kinis ng skin and ano talaga. So ano ba ang ano mo? Sige nga, i-share na rin natin yan. Your skin care. Pwede mo i- ano din, i-share sa ating pepsers. Baka sila rin gusto makita ang secrets sa iyong glass skin. Siguro for me, ano, less is more. Ayun. Mm. Um, hindi kasi naman din ako masyadong mga skincare routine. Yun nga, siguro less is more. You know, yung, yung kailangan mo lang talaga for your face is all you really need to put. And if marami ka masyado rin nilalagay sa face mo, diba? Parang, um, who knows kung ano yung mga nasa products na yun. So, it's really just to keep things simple talaga. Yung mga kailangan nyo lang. So, <laughs> less is more. And water. Kale. Water. water. Water, yes. Very important. <laughs> oh, si Leia Ross is my question. Ano ang plans mo sa Valentine's Day? I will be working. <laughs> oh, lahat, <laughs> Valentine's lahat ang pinanong natin yun, yun ang sagot. Working din talaga. Uh, uh, yeah, no, but yeah, I will be working. I'm going to be um shooting some exciting things for my YouTube channel. 
on yeah. Valentine's Day. Sakto talagang Valentine's Day, you know? Pero yeah, I'm going to be, um yeah, working on Valentine's Day. Mm-hmm. So, yun Uh-oh. ang plans. Oh, ayan. Nasagot na si, yeah. ano pangalan na? Si Leia Rosas. O, kung meron pa kayong questions sa magaganda for Isabel, share nyo lang dyan para mm-hmm. maano natin, ma-read, no? Pero bago yun, kasi Isabel, hindi pwedeng hindi ka dadaan dito sa aming favorite segment. Ito ang aming last segment. Pero syempre, kung may mga tanong kayo, pwede naman natin niya itanong. Hahanapan naman natin yan. Pero, kailangan mo nang daanan mo ito. At ito ang ating <laughs> Tap challenge! Okay. Hey, tap challenge. And your tap challenge for tonight is guilty or not guilty. <laughs> Dapat pala hindi mo na ito yung pinagawa ko sa'yo. Parang mas maganda ito kung lahat kayong vault is five ang gagawa. But anyway, <laughs> parang mas maganda. Okay, so five questions lang naman ito. Then you'll say lang, you're, you'll answer lang kung guilty ka or not guilty. And... Stay mo lang kung ano ang nangyari, bakit nyo nang iyong answer. So, ready ka na ba, Isabel, for our challenge? Okay. Sige, ready. Oo, oh, hindi pwedeng ano, walang explanation. Yun yung chance mo okay. to justify your answer. Sabay. Ano, di ba? Okay. Mag-gets. Okay. Hmm. Uh, first question, guilty or not guilty? Google yourself. Guilty. I feel like, mm-hmm. I feel like lahat naman tayo ginagawa yun at some point. Pero it's not like, it's, I mean, yeah, I've Googled myself naman na rin once. So, just to see, just to see what people have been, ano, have been saying. Wow. Ayun. Uh, what did you see? Nakita ko, yung picture ko nung 16 pa ako. Yun, yung, yun pa rin yung picture ko hanggang ngayon. So, sabi ko, kailan mo palitan to. Correct. Ayun. Mm-hmm. sa so picture lang naman. Pero wala ka namang, wala ka namang, ano, fake news na kailangan mong i-correct or assumption na gusto mong i-break na nakita mo sa Google. Wala naman. At saka, yun, the last time I did was when the reveal yung um, na part kami ng Voltus 5. Eh. So, I was reading reviews, I was reading reactions of everybody, and yun, sobrang nakakatuwa. So, wala naman, wala naman fake news. <laughs> Just, In ano, fairness naman, sa iyo parang walang, ano, masyadong objection. Kasi nga, ayan, no, sabi ni, Putin, Narnia, one of my favorites. Pretty and Aww. young. Very respectable image. She doesn't have to bear more skin to look sexy. Sana simulan ng Voltes 5. Bakit may ganun? Sexy ba si Jamie? Kaya ako binasa kasi akala ko may ganun lotion. <laughs> parang iba pala. Uh, uh, pero at least, diba? Paragraph yun, ah. Uh, uh. Yes, thank you. Thank you very yeah. much. Okay, I-, I love Isabel Ortega. She's absolutely perfect beauty. Uh, diba? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Okay, next. Guilty or not guilty? Napagalitan ng director. Or pwede natin or yan ha, producer, or someone higher than you sa set. Guilty. Guilty, okay. <laughs> guilty. Anything um, that ano, you can share, yung talagang remarkable, yung di mo makalimutan. I remember first, ano ko yun, one of my first projects. Ayun, and because yun nga wala pa naman talaga ako experience before um medyo nangangapa pa talaga ako during my first few um time taping tapos i remember i had an essay due in two hours and i was up next for the scene so legit as in habang habang naghihintay ako ng mag on the set kami gumagawa ako ng essay pero na memorize ko naman na yung, yung yung script ko and everything sabi ko okay kaya ko na to mag mag essay muna ako so by the time na natapos ko na yung essay yung tinawag na din ako tapos nakalimutan ko yung lines ko oh, so, okay. para na sa ang nasa ang nasa utak ko noon yung essay ko <laughs> so nakalimutan ko yung linya ko and of course yun pagalitan ako ng director bakit di daw ako nagprepare and everything which is of course um, understood naman talaga kasi syempre you have to be professional if you're at work kailangan talaga prepared ko when you're on the set so it was my bad naman din talaga pero yun sobrang umiyak ako after <laughs> kasi oh, you know, alam mo yun nagbasa naman ako it's just uh, it's a uh, na talaga na nagblank talaga ako nun uh, tapos I was with a veteran actor pa nun dun sa eksena yun so sobrang nakakahiya pero yeah you learn from you learn from those experiences talaga <laughs> ay ito born for you days you know ano, basta, basta ano, hiya kasi ako sabihin. Okay. Kasi baka, figure out nila, basta yun, one of my first okay. few shows. Yes. Mm-hmm. Correct. Ako kasi nung kita, una nakita, siya hindi sa out, baka hindi lang ako nanonood ng out wall, kaya gano'n. Ha, sa board team. Oo. Okay. O, saktong-sakta sa question ni Abigail Villasante, itong next guilty mm-hmm. or not guilty question natin. No? 
stalked a co-star on social media. Guilty. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Guilty, of course. Especially pag alam mo, makakasama mo yung mga co-stars mo na yun, di ba? Siyempre, you'd want to know more about them. Yeah. And, yeah, guilty. So, I, so lahat ng co-stars mo sa Voltes 5 na check mo na sa social media? Mm-hmm. Diba? <laughs> lalo na nung una, lalo na nung una pa lang. <laughs> sa kanilang, ano, no, sa Voltes team, wala ka pang nakasama or kilala ever before plunging into the project. Um, na nakatrabaho? Oh, or parang kakilala, even way back, ganon. Even before kayo nag-meet sa Voltes. Well, wala pa. I mean, I, siguro sa mga events lang, like sa mm. mga parties ng GMA, ayun, I, I, I think, dun, nakalala ko dun si Miguel, pero everyone else, yun, dahil super newbies pa kami, yeah. most of us, like, ayun, um, Radson, I think, sa All Out Sundays, na-meet ko na siya before. Pero yung talagang co-work, hindi pa talaga. Mm-hmm. Sabagay kasi sino ba naman hindi nakakakilala kay Miguel ngayon, di ba? Of <laughs> course. Na, no, yes. Blawin pala, star shock pala. Uh-huh. Then, of course. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, next. Ito, guilty or not guilty? Broke your own diet. Guilty, guilty, guilty. Guilty, so guilty. <laughs> <laughs> guilty or proud. <laughs> Are you the type na ma-diet? Do you follow, follow yung mga fad? No naman. Kasi, I mean, I think, medyo mabilis pa kasi yung metabolism ko eh. As of now. So, hindi ko pa naman talaga kailangan mag-diet. Pero, tuwing kailangan ko mag-diet, medyo, medyo nabibreak ko din. Pero, hindi rin ako guilty for that. I mean, guilty, but at the same time, not guilty. <laughs> kasi nga, hindi ka naman talagang yung nagpo-follow ng mga strict uh-uh. na diet. Uh-uh. Just Basta that, mag-reduce i- lang, gano'n. Uh-uh. Basta i-workout i- ko na lang yun some other time. Basta i-enjoy ko okay. na lang itong burger na to, gano'n. <laughs> okay. Tama naman. Yeah. Okay, oh, itong next. Last question. Guilty or not guilty? Had an embarrassing moment on stage. Lahat ng, lahat ng questions na ito, guilty. Yeah, guilty nga, yun ang perfect. Oh, perfect score. Okay. Oh, oh, perfect oh ano nangyari score. dyan? I remember may isa akong ano, mall show out of town. And I remember kinailangan kong mag... Oh, kailangan kong maghagis ng posters. <laughs> so, syempre, kumakanta ka nun, di ba? So, you have your mic on one hand, yung poster sa isang hand, or yung poster mo nandito, tapos ibabato mo, di ba? So, I remember kumakanta ako nun on stage. Tapos, ang gusto ko sanang ibato is yung poster. Pero yung nabato ko is yung mic. <laughs> so, I remember, oh my, I remember noon. Yeah, so sabi ko, ala, nasa na yung mic ko. Tapos naalala ko, narinig ko ang lakas ng thud. Like, dug. Like, gumanon talaga <laughs> yung, yung mic dun sa tao. Noon, tug, nakita ko talaga slow motion. Napunta talaga sa noon nung, nung nanonood yung mic. Tapos I felt so bad. Tapos sila pa mismo rin yung nag-sorry sa akin nung mic. Oh, iba- so, sabi ko, oh, sorry talaga. Tapos hindi ko man lang nun yung bigyan ng poster. So, <laughs> Nakakahiya. Mm-hmm. Pero yun, sobrang nahiya ako. No? Kasi rinig din talaga nung buong, buong event, yung talagang dug, yung pag gano'n nung mic. Oh my God! Oo. Yes, so, okay ka lang. Kuya ba siya? Oo, oh, okay. ate. Ay, ate. Ayun. Ate, I hope yeah. you're okay. Oh, pero pero nahalap na- naman siya. Oh. Ah, oh, nahalap na- na- naman siya nun. Oo, nag-sorry ako sa kanya personally. Kasi <laughs> siya pero naman, ang oh, sakit mo yung mic yun eh. <laughs> Napaka-humble ni ano, ni Isabel. Talagang hinanap niya. <laughs> oh, sabi ni, naalala pa ni Jung Davi, yung natapon yung mic sa araw-gabi mall show. O, oh, diba? Naalala niya kung kailan. Yan, naalala pa siya yun. Ikaw ba yan? Charo. Ikaw ba yan, Jung? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, if ikaw, ikaw yan. yan. Uh-huh. Oh, ito na si Isabel. Nagsas sorry na siya ulit. Yes, very sorry. Until now, hindi, pa rin, hindi ko pa rin nakakalimutan yun. <laughs> Pero nga naman kasi minsan nakikarried away ka, di ba? Oo, oh, oh, <laughs> lalo na ang energy nung, nung kanta ko nun, eh, biglang, boom, wala, dulas ng kamay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, sabi ni Geraldine, siya ata yun. Ikaw yata yan, Jung. Sabihin mo lang sa amin. At least, eto na, nag-apologize na si ano. Yes. Okay. Question ni Rain Tan. Ten years from now, ano sa tingin mo ang ginagawa mo that time? So, te- you're 33 by then. Mm, 33. 
Hopefully, still acting, of course. Um, ano pa ba? 33? Other roles na, gano'n. Kasi nasa 30s na gano'n. <laughs> let, let, yeah, let's see, di ba? Pero okay. yun, um, gusto ko, by that time, dami ko nang na, na travel. Ayun. Gusto ko, marami na rin ako na-experience sa life by the time I'm 33. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Da, yeah. what the best. Oh, siya rin na nagtanong, what makes you happy? All caps kasi eh. So, Wah! tanong natin. All no? caps, what makes me happy? Um, hmm. Siguro ano, yung the little things ngayon in life, di ba? Kasi if you're going to dwell on the negative things, parang na nasasayang yung moment na yun. So, siguro yun, it's the little things that make me happy ngayon. Yung mga certain moments ngayon na masasaya na na-experience ko. And just enjoying everything right now that's happening. Yun na ba? Hmm. At least, no? Hindi kasi, di ba, simula nung no, nagkaroon talaga ng pandemic, parang lahat tayo nagpalit, na, nagbago ng mindset na, yes. you know, the simplest things can make us happy. And Mm-mm. yung mabuhay lang, di ba? Yung ganun. Yes. Oo, and Yun, working, of course, that's one of the things that make me happy right now. Correct. Okay. Isa sa mga kanina pa na may mention dito, kinakamas nila yung dog mo, si Tonyo, siya yun, tama? Okay, wrong ako. Si Tonyo. <laughs> no, because, um, hindi, Tonyo is technically not my dog. Pero, hmm. um, isa rin, kasi, um, a few, a few days ago kasi, nag-live kami for Sparkle, um, nag-live kami ni Miguel, for, mm-hmm. for Sparkle. And then, I remember yun, nabanggit namin na meron kami kasamang stray dog dun sa, sa live stream na yun. Si ah. Tony. Pinala namin Tony. <laughs> okay. So, mm-hmm. okay, naman, okay pa rin naman ata si Tony. <laughs> Pero do you own your own dog? I have a lot of dogs. Sobrang dog person po ako, Jim P. I, I have four Shih Tzus na house dogs and then on top of that, Dami pa namin ibang dogs. May bullies kami. I think we have, ano, four bullies. Tapos pregnant din yung bully namin ngayon. So, ayun, malaki yung, ano, namin, um, doggy family namin dito. Grabe. So, super, ano, dog lover nga, no? Mm, Oye, meron pa tayo, yeah. ano, two minutes bago mag one hour. So, okay. meron kayo yung mga questions. Itanong nyo na. Pero si Rain Tan. O, di ba, panalo naman si Rain Tan sa mga pa-beauty yes. queen Q&A niya. Hello, Rain. Kung pandemic ate, ano po yung na-discover mo sa sarili mo? Ha? Huh. Good question. Uh, siguro, ano, na-discover ko na kaya ko pala maging patient. <laughs> Ayun. Kasi, syempre, I think yung 2020 talaga, ito sa year of waiting. Siguro for me, you know, waiting for work to start again and then um, waiting to graduate. <laughs> so, yun, I think waiting, yung patience talaga. And sobrang nag-pay off naman din yung patience na yun. And yung faith then syempre, na, you know, things will go back to normal. So, yeah, siguro yun. Everything happens for a reason. And super, yun talaga yung mantra ko nung pandemic. And everything's paid off naman. Everything's worth the wait. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I thank you. Wow. Yes, thank you. Uh, uh, from Beauty Queen question to Slam Book question, si Isabel okay. Hearts. Favorite okay. color ni Isabel? <laughs> ano, right now, hula, hulaan nyo guys uh, sa background ko. White. <laughs> white mm. and ano, yes, white. I, like, I love white. Mm-mm. Buong kwarto ko halos white. <laughs> Nasa room ka ba or ano? Living room niya. Nasa room. So, siya ng room eh. Ano, <laughs> couch na Ang ganda. Hindi, kasi nga kanina ko pa pinapansin. Di ba? Ang ganda oh, ko. Ano. Thank you. Simple so, ko yan eh. Kasi dati, ito, study desk ko to. Tapos sabi ko, pag mag-graduate na ako, gusto ko parang tambay area na lang. Kasi hindi ko na kailangan mag-aral. So, gusto ko, basta uh-huh. na lang ako dito sa kwarto ko na to. So, kaya ako may couch. <laughs> Correct. At least, di ba? Parang pinahinga mo na ang self mo. Minsan kasi yeah. may negative notion na yung desk, eh, no? lalo na kapag ang dami uh-huh. mo nagawang kabisihan doon. So parang ah, gusto mo ang pahinga. Uh-huh. Eh, paano yun sa kanina nag-edit ng vlogs mo? Here, then. Dito din. Ah, nakaganyan ka na lang. Uh, nakaganyan lang ako. Ayan, may coffee table ako. Tapos nandito na lang ako sa sofa. Siyempre, mas relax na yung environment ko. Uh-huh. Kasi hindi ko na kailangan mag-aral. So nakaganyan na lang ako. And of course, I have a team. <laughs> 
also. So, we edit together din. Ayun. Mm-hmm. Ayun. O, oh, ito last na lang. Si Resley May Rivero. Ano po ang favorite food mo? Mga paano, magsisend tila. Charot. Favorite food? Pancit Canton. Ah, really? As in, Pancit yes. Canton na totoong Pancit Canton or the ano? Pat. Yung simple Instant. pack lang. Ah, uh-uh. <laughs> tapos with cheese. Yan. Masarap. Oh, Favorite with cheese? Oo. Uh, uh. Kind of flavor. Discovery yan. Nang cheese? Ah, nung cheese. Hindi, nung pancit kanto. <laughs> ano? Uh, flavor ng cheese, sorry. Kalamansi. Yeah, chili mm. masir kalamansi. Tapos with cheese. Yeah. Favorite ko yan. Yeah. Super. Mm-hmm. You try that again. Pancit kanto, kalamansi, flavor with cheese. Cheese, yes. Yan. Yeah. All with that. Ito na, of course, Isabel. You may, ano, thank your fans and your, your parting words for them. And of course, invite them for your sa ano mo, upcoming projects, vlog uploads, and your social media. Ito na, pwede mo lang ichika sa kanila lang. Yes. Ayan, guys, of course, Pepsters, thank you so much for watching. I had so much fun spending this evening with you all. And of course, guys, um, on my social media accounts, Isabel Ortega on everything. Um, yes, right there. <laughs> and yun, Voltus 5 Legacy, guys. Abangan nyo yan. And we've been working so hard for it. And of course, what we could be this 2022 with Miguel and um, Yasser and um, Quantum Films. So yeah, abangan nyo yan, guys. Um, we've been working so hard para, um, for these for these projects. So we can't wait for you guys to enjoy. And um, yeah, abangan. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much, Isabel, for being with us sa iyong first time, no? And sana magkaroon ng susunod. Na-excite ako. Bale mo, ano na, pwede nang pagchikahan ang what we could be. And of course, yeah. more info about, ano, Voltes 5, di ba? And for our Pepsters, thank you din syempre sa pagsama sa amin. And for the past, how many months? Simula August 2020. Thank you din sa pagsama sa amin sa time slot na to, every Tuesday and Thursday. But starting next week, may mga mangyayaring changes sa amin. Marami na kayo, marami kayo makikitang live. Maraming chances na makipag-interact kayo with your favorite artists na guests namin. Pero hindi na kami mapapanood every Tuesday and Thursday. Come what may, i-announce yeah, na lang namin sa social media accounts namin kung kailan nyo mapapanood ng inyong favorite artist. So, i-continue nyo lang na i-comment sa amin. I-suggest nyo kung sino mga gusto nyo mapanood. Pero yun nga, basta aabangan nyo na lang sa social media kung kailan namin kung kailan kayo, pwede maki-interact sa kanila and kung kailan magsisigaan. But of course, tuloy-tuloy pa rin ang live. And thank you, Isabel. At least masaya yung ating last Thursday show na 7pm. Yes, so, I'm so you. grateful. Thank you for having me for this uh, last Thursday show. Yeah, thank super you. grateful then And of course, ayan, sa Namagit ko kanina, abangan nyo lang sa aming social media account so pwede nyo rin kami i-follow dyan. Lalabas sa inyong mga screen and mag-subscribe sa aming YouTube channel. Just search Pep TV sa YouTube at makakita nyo dyan ito kung kailan na mga Pep Live, ang aming mga video sa Pep Spotlight and of course, ang aming show, ang Pep Comedy Hour na nag-premiere every Friday at 9pm. And of course, visit www.pep.ph for your daily dose of showbiz news and updates. Ako rin, pwede nyo i-follow sa social media, pero kung hindi nyo type, okay lang din, basta mahalaga ay makanood kayo ng aming mga programa dito sa Pep. Isabel, thank you so much. Maraming salamat. Thank so, you. Sorry, ko sinabi. Hindi ka alam kasi yan eh. Mara alam na nila, okay. di ba? Baka magulat ka. Uh, oh, may ganap. Of course. Walang ganap. So, Thank you, Isabel. Super duper. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. I had so much fun. Yes, yeah. I had so much fun spending the evening with you and with everyone. Thank you all for having me. Yes, thank you so much, Isabel. And thank you, Pepster, sa pagsama sa amin. And magkita-kita tayo ulit sa ating susunod na Pep Live. Bye, everyone, and have a great weekend sa inyong lahat. <laughs>